everyone welcome to fitness fest Ruante here and today we are going to talk about another piece of popular gym equipment and that is the leg extension machine let's see what it's all about Quadriceps femoris or quads for short consists of four individual muscles rectus femoris, vastus lateralis, vastus medialis and vastus intermedius. They form the main bulk of the thigh and collectively it is one of the most powerful muscle groups in the body. Quadriceps are knee extensors meaning they are responsible for the straightening of the knee. The vastus muscles originate at the femur where the rectus femoris is attached at the hip. The rectus femoris is also responsible for hip flexion. They are crucial in walking, running, jumping and squatting. The major benefit of the leg extension is that it gives you the chance to control the movement focusing on your quad, making it a really good isolation exercise. That means you can move with control, slowing down the contraction at your pace and slowing it at certain phases, building that mind-muscle connection. It also plays a critical role in rehab for patients who have gone through knee surgery where they have to retrain their knee back to its hinging motion. Make sure to align your knees with the pivot point at the end of the seat by adjusting the back pad and press your lower back firmly against it. The roller should be on a comfortable position at the front of your ankles. Do not rest it on your shins. Start the movement with your feet positioned a few inches out rather than underneath as it decreases the tension on your knees. Adjust the movement lever so it's at an angle that makes starting easy. Curl your toes up toward your body as you extend your legs and focus on contracting your quad muscles. Keep your core engaged to help you balance in the seat. Pause at full extension and slowly return to the starting position. If you already have pains in your knees, you might want to skip this one. Again, the placement of the load relative to your knee creates a lot of torque. So this move isn't worth risking an injury if you already have knee pains. Aside from training the quads, this exercise does not involve any other muscle. Just as we talked about before, it is an isolation exercise, meaning it is not effective for improving overall leg strength. For that, you need to do compound movements like squats, deadlifts, lunges and step-ups. If you are an athlete who is trying to run, jump or play sports better, again, this isn't the best move for you. Most real-life leg movements do not solely involve knee extension. So if that is your goal, ditch this isolation exercise for more of compound movements. Leg extensions solely develop quads. So if that's the main focus of your leg workout, in the long term, your legs will gradually develop imbalances. As your quads get stronger, you need to make sure to strengthen your hamstrings as well. If you do leg extensions, offset them with hamstring exercises. You do not need to load the machine up to its maximum capacity to get the benefit. And at the same time, maxing out the machine can have serious issues. In general, the further a weight is from the operating joint, the more the muscle and the joint have to deal with the torque. That means you will feel the leg extensions in the muscle, but if you put too much weight, you will stress your knee joint over time. And that is why you have to be careful with throwing weight around because you need to protect that knee joint. Thank you so much for tuning in guys. If you found this video helpful, share it with a friend. And do not forget to like, comment and subscribe. Click the bell icon down below so that you will never miss any of our videos. Until next time, stay safe, stay fit.